Hunt with passion. Never stop casting. Chase the dream. Welcome to Season 3 of Musky Mastery Outdoors. Sponsored by Joe Booker Outdoors. Number one in big game fish products. Your shirts with electricity, not fire? Ooh, here she is. She took a weird dart at it. Oh, got her, dude! Oh, oh! Uh, quick fish. Hang on, I'll bring her this way if I can. All right, tell you, here she comes. Oh, she's hooked well. Nice job, dude! Nice job, man! We got her right on the moon! Dude, no way! Oh my gosh, Ty! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my gosh, did we work hard for this muskie? Oh, did we work hard for you? We were waiting for you, waiting for you, waiting for you. Oh, come here, girl. All right, Tyler. There she is, man. Gorgeous musky, guys, right on moonrise within a minute. Despite all these storms, we couldn't get any activity, but the moon is it's just incredible. It's influence on these muskies and their feeding behavior right in the figure eight. Finally got one to go. Let's get her back and I'll tell you exactly what it took to get this fish to strike. Wow. Guys, figure eight muskies, I mean, you're toe-to-toe -to -toe with these critters, man. I mean, it's it's an arm wrestle. You gotta literally, you, know, you gotta lift a couple weights every once in a while to battle these bad boys. Wow, man. Thunderstorms, thunderstorms, thunderstorms. Nothing got these fish going. It was the moon. Right on moonrise, good spot. Wow. coffee 2 p.m. You know why? Because we've been we've been hunting muskies here, Tyler Andrews and I, for probably 10 hours. Haven't moved any muskies despite this ridiculous weather. We've got storm front after storm front moving through here and uh, you would think this classic weather here, it's it's musky weather, the thunder's booming, we're getting off the water, getting out, getting into, you know, cover and you know out of this uh, out of the lightning. There's no, no muskies moving. So again, what do you do in this scenario? Well, we decided to come back out between storms and we're probably gonna get blown right off the water again, but we decided to come back out because we were approaching moonrise. It still baffles me how powerful the moon is and its influence on feeding behavior of big predators like muskies. This muskie struck within plus or minus one minute of moonrise. And even then, it wasn't just a pow this fish came into the figure eight. It was a skills muskie. If you didn't do a good figure eight on this fish, probably not gonna happen. Probably probably would have been a follow that you would have you would have talked about at the bar. Good figure eight skills, really, really important on this muskie. And uh, a, a lot of different pieces going into this. I could hit on a bunch of them here. Uh, downsizing, tough bite, small blade, 500 series Booker tail, Booker tail tinsel. The spot on the spot, on the moon face. So where do you go on a moon face? your best spot. Not just your best spot though, it's the best spot on your best spot. And by that I, I mean like if you have a reef, what particular rock 
produces those muskies the most consistently. That's where you want your casts landing at Moonrise. This fish was exactly like that. Tyler and I were reminiscing uh, just a few minutes earlier before this muskie hit about this particular boulder that we've caught them off of for years, and that's where that muskie came off of. Equipment here, you know, figure eight muskies like that. This fish gave me a pretty big tussle. St. Croix's Legend Elite nine footer. This is their medium heavy. Probably the best rod for, you know, bucktail topwater fishing and for figure eights. You're, you see this muskie just gave me a run for my money around the boat. And, you know, you need, it's, it's the length helps in the figure eights because you don't have to bend down as far, but it also helps because it key, it's your secondary drag system. I was free, free spooling this fish a little bit, but the longer rod takes a lot of the, uh, the you know, the, the head shakes and it, it really keeps those hooks pinned in the muskie. So anyway, to sum up guys, tough bite even with the weather, pay attention to that moon and be on your best spot when it happens and you'll score. Hope you enjoyed this segment and as always, thanks for watching. Thank you.